Bristol to May. How's he come out of the Betfair chase? Everything absolutely fine, yeah. yeah no worries at all. You know, Mike Bite obviously underperformed uh, for whatever reason. Um, we'd always hope, you know, we'd have a bit more speed than Native River perhaps around that sort of track. You know, he, is, he can be quite fragile, but what you've got to remember, he's only seven and he's probably just really strengthening up now and he's probably just coming to his very best now. So hopefully we won't have the problems we used to have. And how confident of upholding that form with Native River and, and Mike Bite, Thistle Crack in the King George at Kempton? Well, again, um, you know, Mike Bite's a bit of an enigma. You know, if he comes back to his absolute best, it'll be hard work. But uh, um, is, is, the right, is that the right track for Native uh, River? Not sure. Um, Thistle Crack would be quite a worry because he, um, you know, he, he did very well up at uh, um, Haydock after a long time off. So well, I'm, not, I'm not saying we're going to win, but we'll run very well. And so in terms of the track, a speedy track like Kempton, that, that's not a concern for you? Well, Haydock nowadays, I think people tell you, is a pretty speedy track um, on that ground, so no, I, I think speed isn't the problem. Before Haydock, he was categorised as a heavy ground specialist, but he, he put that uh, to bed last time out on good ground. So conditions, no worries at all? No worries at all. Um, you know, I think he, he, he does just get other horses at it and it's easier in, in, in heavy ground. Um, so, you know, we're very hopeful.